Welcome. In this video, I'm going to be taking a look at this Nakus Flexible Gooseneck LED Desk Lamp. So this was provided to me by the distributor, but they're not compensating me for this video and they're not reviewing it before I post it. If you find this video helpful and you want to purchase one of these, I'll put a link to it in the description on Amazon. And if you use that link, it helps me out a little bit and doesn't cost you anything extra. So let's get this open. Here's a user manual. We have the specs. It's 12 watts, has 108 surface mount LEDs. It's made of aluminum alloy, metal, and plastic, has a touch control, smooth dimming, has three color temperatures, 3000K, 4500K, and 6000K, 10 brightness levels. The lamp head length is 15.7 inches, the gooseneck length is 24.8 inches, and the desk clamp width is 2.1 inches. It says long press to adjust the brightness, short press to switch to three color modes or to turn on or off, and here are some dimensions here. So in this orientation, it's about two foot off the table. So here we have the power adapter, that's 12 watts. This is the lamp head. The cord is around five foot in length. Here's the gooseneck, and here's the clamp. So the clamp has padding on the fixed part and the adjustable part. So I'll clamp this onto my bench here. Okay, so that's very secure. Let's take a little close up at this flex arm here. So this is metal here, the cord is in the middle of it. This will fit in the clamp and this is straight and this part flexes and it has a sort of rubber coating on it. And then we have a sort of barrel jack connector in this end. So I'll place that in the clamp. It's almost out of frame here, but you can tighten this down. Now this has a barrel jack on it, but it also has some O-rings here. I think that's to hold this on a little tighter. So I'll slip this on. Okay, now I'll plug the barrel jack in from the power supply into the cord down here by the clamp. I'll plug that into power. I'm going to move this over a little bit. So let's turn it on. So here's the button here, and we can rotate this. So this is changing the color temperature. So here we have warm, this is a blue, and this is more of a white. And then if we hold down on it, it will dim it. So that's going down, this is going up. So let me turn the overhead lights off. So hold my finger down on here, this is going to get bright. So when you dim it, you hold your finger down until it's the brightness you want, and then take your finger off. And if you put your finger back on, hold it down, it'll go the opposite direction. So if it went bright last time, it will go dim, and it goes back and forth. So if you want to dim it all the way, You'll hold it down until it's at the lowest level, but still on. So this is the dimmest. It's kind of hard to see what this looks like on camera. I think it looks a little brighter in person, but I can read this, but it's a little dim for my liking. Let me turn it up a little bit at least. That's a little more comfortable for me for reading here, although I typically would turn it up all the way. So I like this white light. If I'm trying to relax in the evening, I'd probably turn it to that warm color temperature. Now in the morning, I would probably want more of the cool color temperature. So this is currently around 14 inches from my bench. I'm going to move the flex arm and move it up higher. So now I'm just under 24 inches. So now I'm on max brightness. And here you can kind of see how much of my bench this is lighting up. So it's lighting up quite a bit of my bench. Now I have this mounted on the front of my bench. Typically would not mount a lamp on the front of your bench. I did it for convenience for my video. Typically you would mount it to the side or the back. But this looks really nice here. I'll shut it off so you can see what it was like before. And if we turn it on, let's go to the lowest. So here it is on the lowest. This is just kind of a faint glow right now. But it is lighting up a wide area of the bench. So here we can see how you can aim this here. This is very flexible, so you can put it in all sorts of orientations. And of course, you can also rotate this light all the way around. So if you wanted to point it at a wall or something, you can do that. So that's Naku's LED Flexible Gooseneck Desk Lamp. That's all I'm going to cover in this video. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. If you like this video, please click like. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate it if you could do that. And thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye.